So here's my train of thought. I was asking myself the question, is there research, medical research on the dyspraxia brain? Maybe, maybe not. But this, this is a psychological thing. So, so you know, quick question. What is psychology? It's the study of the mind and behavior. So let's give some examples of psychology. We have the mind of the intellect, the mind of the entrepreneur, the mind of the psychopath, the mind of someone um, who's resistant, the mind of someone who has dyspraxia, etc. Here's an interesting statistic. 20% of entrepreneurs are dyslexic. Why is that? Well, some say it's partly because people with dyslexia think differently. So here's another question. Do people with dyspraxia think differently? And if that premise is correct, then there's potential here. The dyspraxia brain or the dyspraxia mind has the potential to achieve if this premise is correct. So obviously there's barriers presented by dyspraxia and those barriers potentially make life more difficult. But it's fair to say, or is it fair to say, that difficulties can build perseverance and to achieve anything we need perseverance. So if you can fine tune the dyspraxia brain, you have optimal perseverance. And why is that important? That's important because perseverance has significant value.